This podcast is part of the Bomb Pod Media Network. From DailyDoseOfWeirdNews.com, I'm Darren Marlar, and this is your Daily Dose of Weird News. Charles Manson, the 1960s cult leader whose followers committed multiple murders in his name and who was serving nine life sentences, died yesterday at age 83. And he was really convinced that 2018 was finally going to be the year he got released on parole. Ah, too bad, Charlie. The higher a woman's education, the better the chance both she and her partner will have a long life, according to research from the Swedish Institute for Social Research in Stockholm, Sweden. Oddly, the level of a wife's education was a stronger factor in lowering her husband's risk of dying over the next 10 years than the man's own level of education. So, looks like I'll be forcing my wife to go back to college. A study has found that a family of four living in the San Francisco Bay Area with two working adults must earn around $80,000 just to pay for basic necessities. And for that nearly 80 grand, you get to live in a cardboard box down by Fisherman's Wharf. The San Antonio couple faces charges of public lewdness after theater employees reported catching the two having sex during a movie last week. You thought the guy texting behind you was annoying. According to a study, 11.17 a.m. is the time of day where you are most miserable. But cheer up, because lunch is less than an hour away, and by 2, you'll be fast asleep under your desk. After 19 minutes of dueling with four bidders on the telephone and one in the room, Leonardo da Vinci's Salvatore Mundi sold last Wednesday night for $450.3 million. They could have bought the poster for four bucks. A husband creates seven additional hours of housework each week for women. But when men get married, it saves them an hour a week when it comes to household chores, according to a study by the University of Michigan's Institute for Social Research. In general, married women do far more housework than they would if they were single, while men do less. Well, yeah, I mean, why do you think we ask you to marry us to begin with? A prosecutor in the Dallas District Attorney's Office was fired after an Uber driver recorded her violent, profanity-filled rant against him. Now she's going to have to do what everybody else does when they're out of work – become an Uber driver. Add Facebook depression to potential harms linked with social media, an influential doctor's group warns, referring to a condition it says may affect troubled teens who obsess over the online site. Researchers disagree on whether it's simply an extension of depression some kids feel in other circumstances or a distinct condition linked with using the online site. Well, how could it not be depressing when you can instantly see people unfriend you? After being refused Chicken McNuggets for breakfast, a man in Australia ordered 200 hash browns. Employees at the McDonald's refused and called police. The man was drunk, so he'd already had enough carbs for the day. Hey guys, forget the champagne or the wine. If you're looking for a romantic evening with your lady, Fix her a glass of organic licorice tea and leave out some good and plenty licorice candy to snack on. Turns out the scent of licorice drives women crazy. In fact, a study discovered that women who were around the smell of licorice were far more likely to be in the mood compared to women who were around the scent of men's cologne. Of course, you know what the obvious conclusion is to this, right? Coming soon, licorice Old Spice. It's the most wonderful time of the year here at Marlar House. Every year at this time, I ask you to join me in bringing a Christmas miracle to those who are starving around the world. And right now, you can give a financial gift of any size to Food for the Poor by clicking the Give Life banner at DailyDoseOfWeirdNews.com. For every $50 we raise, it's another child in the Caribbean or Latin America who will be fed for an entire year and will receive clean water for life. Be as generous as you can. And also, please encourage your friends and family to give as well by sharing a link to DailyDoseOfWeirdNews.com so they can click on the Give Life banner as well. And thank you in advance for whatever you can give. Get the Daily Dose of Weird News podcast for Apple or Android at DailyDoseOfWeirdNews.com. And please leave a review on iTunes if you like the show. I'm Darren Marlar, and I'll see you next time, weirdos.